So Jenny, what was your struggle or what was your like in very young age you started yeah. modeling? Just like first year of my intern. So I was too young to deal with all those things. Hmm. But somehow my mom pushed me. That's why I uh, participated in Miss Vizag. You didn't try it again, no, Miss India? No, I didn't try but I was like satisfied with that. Whatever thing. you have. Yeah. The first my project thing. what you got? It was a saris thing. Uh, I don't even know how to wear a yeah, sari. Okay. Wear a sari. <laughs> Almost changed 35 saris that day. Oh ho. I remember I am getting for 35 saris. I got 3,500 rupees. So 100 rupees uh, for one change. Oh. And uh, even today, the store in Vizag still have that pictures. Any celebrity with uh, you did, but that time you always oh my, uh, I'm going to work with him or something. Your first. Uh, at. Uh, Raghav is son of Satyanand Garu who is a good friend of mine. Okay. He did my first photo shoot. <laughs> Satyanand Garu was like... That's when I really got, I wanted to do a couple of ads, like video ads. You will so not be ads. a normal cook. <laughs> You're a professional chef. Whenever people come, no, I want that attention. Okay. <laughs> So why you kept it all these? Uh... And this is sweet with kajus. Wow. <laughs> kept it on like one yeah. two months ka. Actually the thing <laughs> is now it is less. Previously it was completely full. Okay. <laughs> so you had your fan moment. One person literally followed me till the house. Okay. I used to stay in some other community then. Saw me in the mall. But I wanted to share it with a different question. Hmm. So now I'll not answer this, but I'll answer <laughs> this. So you find modeling is better like influencer earning more? So yes, there is uh, definitely huge money for the influencers mm. and in coming days it's going to be more. Pratikala is something is like a very, 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 very special in my life. Mm. So any of your incident you would like to share or something? There are a lot of celebrities who stay inside mm -hmm. uh, Lanko, even like uh, singer Sunita Garu is one of a very sweet and kind uh, person. So what kind of shopping lover she is? She mm. is a very good customer for sarees. What kind kind of sari she buys like she always loves to wear falling saris not falling. that sticky and mm -hmm. uh, heavy painted heavy. work and all no because of pratikala i got a uh, uh, very important person in my life which is amamma okay <laughs> she is none other than alu arjun sir's mom and suddenly one day at uh, morning 10 o'clock i got a call that day amamma said just get ready in 10 minutes i'm going to take you to some place i was like where then uh, yeah. But I got an access directly go to the main yeah. dining hall. Amama introduced. She, you, not just you, I, I also have fans. She is my fan. Welcome to my show Trendsetters. Today again, anyway, in my Trendsetter show, you always know that I all keep introducing you all the Trendsetters who actually make a big mark in their life in their young age. Well, today one girl which I've been seeing her from 15 years, like in young age, into the modeling, influencer, entrepreneur, I don't know how many things. She bought her own house in a big place in her own strength. Well, let's find out her own journey that what makes her to make this big mark and make her big dreams in a simpler way. Well, whenever I see her, I just feel like, you know, age is just a bar. Brain doesn't work according to the age. It works with the work hard you need to know. Well, her name is Shruti Varma. So I'll just find out what she's doing, where she stays, what's her journey. All details will be revealed. So let's go and find out where is she. Hmm? So let's come and uh, we'll do a small home tour also and let's find out uh, more about her, what she's doing nowadays and what's her struggle journey also. So I, I'm opening the door. What is this? Yeah, she's opened the door. I mean, I, before going to somebody place, we need to ring, you know, give a bell, right? Let me do my rules, right? Hello, ma'am. Your, your door was open, you know. So I thought, no, I should not go like this, you know. There has to be some courtesy. So, can I? So please come inside and let's. 
Well, uh, you need to welcome me, right? I'm at your home, and thank Please, you so yeah, much, first you, of all, you. that you giving a time and invited us. As you have been doing so many roles, you know, modeling. I was seeing you for 15 years. Then now you become an entrepreneur. Then now you are an influencer. I mean, so mm -hmm. much in your plate. So right. just wanted to explore your journey, the struggle. So I know we used to, you know, call you Jenny. Right. Yeah. But your right. name is. My original name is Shrutika Verma. Okay. Yes. So what was your name change from Jenny to, I mean sorry, Shrutika Verma to Jenny? Okay. Shrutika Verma is my original name and Jenny is my senior who kept uh, it hmm. as a Facebook ID, hmm. Jenny Hani. Hmm. So that went very popular because after that I have actually uh, introduced by one or two event managers as for pigeons. Hmm. Then what happened, slowly I started winning those uh, uh, crowns and all. Hmm. So somehow Jenny got more popular than Shrutika. Shrutika. But I, I would love to call uh, to be called as Shrutika. But what your journey, I can say first of all, my attraction is going more of your house. Yeah. As you are a creative in your field also being into modeling, then influencer, then into the business. Right. It's all creative related. In your house also I can see the small small thing. So yeah. can you would like discover a little bit of tour and then we can sit and sure, talk sure, more. Sure. So this is your drawing room and then we can go see. I, when I came inside, mm -hmm. I was just like this place. It was <laughs> so cozy and you know, yeah. it's a study place or what like? So more of uh, I would love to write. Okay, you're and a writer also. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so uh, whenever I feel like sitting alone and writing, I'll just sit here and write. Uh, and the chairs is, are also you made it very comfortable <laughs> that you know to the height so you can sit. People think it's <laughs> like a bar, but no. It's yeah, just actually, a show. it's just a show. <laughs> you can sit, you know, and yeah. it's a writing writing bar. We can say right. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll have a juice or something, and then I'll just hmm. put some work to my mind and write. Right, keep things, writing. Yeah. So, Jenny, what was your struggle or what was your like in very young age you started yeah. modeling? So, I started my journey with modeling uh, when I was just like first year of my intern, like okay. which is plus one. Okay. After uh, I'm done with my 10, then I'm a KV student. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I, I'm good at Hindi also. Mm -hmm. So, a couple of my North Indian friends, everybody used to always like, mm -hmm. you know, are very close to me. Mm -hmm. Uh, just because I look like most of the times I look like a North Indian for mm -hmm. them. So uh, what happened, couple of my event managers uh, who asked me to participate in uh, pigeons mm -hmm. like uh, Miss Vizag and all. Mm -hmm. So I was too young to deal with all those things. Mm -hmm. But somehow my mom pushed me. Like mm -hmm. my, She is like, you know... Mm -hmm. uh, Somebody who always keeps saying, mm. just go participate. Mm. Forget about winning. Mm. It's not in our hands. Mm. So, it, it will give you a good experience. Mm. That's how I uh, participated in Miss Vizag. And Miss you become? Pra yeah. Oh, wow. Twice. Mm. Uh, Twice you become yeah. Miss Vizag. <laughs> Even that happened. Which year? Good. So, 2011, it was fresh face of Vizag. Mm. And 2012, I wanted to participate one more time. Mm. Uh, because everybody said it was just a luck. Mm. First time when, mm. when I won. Uh, won. Then I thought I'll give one more year try mm. and if it is working out for me, I should mm. plan myself to get into this. Something, uh, yeah. modeling. Right. Mm. So, and I got first runner up uh, in okay. 2012 and then I was supposed to participate. Uh, I wanted to go to Mumbai and... Uh, for Miss India. Yeah, mm. because that's the entry for that. Mm -hmm. Because then it was AP and there's yeah. no AP and Telangana, there's only AP. Ah. So, it's a direct entry to... Miss India. Miss India. Then what happened? <laughs> I didn't go. Uh, there, there are two reasons. Ah. One, if, uh, if I would have participated in 2013 also, maybe I would have got a lot of experience. Mm. Then mm. it's a good choice. The... 2012 when I won, it's the first runner-up. Okay. So I don't have a direct entry, but I okay. have that. I made a little profile by then. Mm. I would have gone, but I don't know. There's lack of uh, too much of mm -hmm. uh, exposure by then. So mm. you didn't try it again, no, Miss India. No, I didn't try, but I was like satisfied with that. Whatever thing. you have. Yeah. You were busy with your projects, and you start getting. Yeah. So what was your age that time? I was into uh, around like 16. So 16, 16 you started 16. your way to modeling. Yeah. Who were your yeah. role model? Uh -huh. Why you wanted to be a model? No, uh, that's what I, I always go with the flow. Okay. I never, uh, you know, thought I'll become a model or I'll work with a lot of brands. I never had a plan about it. 
it, it uh, once i won miss wise i know slowly brand started approaching me for like mm. sari jewelry and this that but you know that time i think modeling was not much a known career and right. it was a like people take it okay do it for some time or you know there were not permissions given by the family did you right. face all this to explain them so maybe if i would have not done that uh, miss wisak thing hmm. maybe it is difficult for me to because but I to get into the miss wisak you have to convince your dad of mm, no, mom the or the good thing is they only push me to go and okay. uh, hmm. do it so hmm. i always have support from my family uh, they, are, they are always like you know go participate in every opportunity that you get so let's not you know bother about the result but mostly people say in south you know modeling they don't prefer the daughters to go into that profession right. how you take See, this my idea and my thought about modeling is totally different hmm. uh if we, if you see uh, any of the hoardings do ev- do you ever find any uh, vulgar uh, hoardings or something no right mm. so there are lot of things in modeling that you know i don't know somehow people have that different thought about it people only have to wear short dresses and they have to expose too much uh, the, the only maybe uh, the other thought about modeling is we have to meet every day new people yes. for a girl for girls no they really people who feel insecure mm. people who are not so confident about uh, the situation that you know they are going to face people who don't know how to deal with the sudden mm-hmm, situations mm-hmm. you know because modeling is sudden opportunity sudden if opportunity if today i don't grab the ad thing no by tomorrow they will go to somebody won't be there yeah so there's lot of things that i have learned it's a uh, uh, yeah there were times where i was like uh, stepping back and mm. no this is not uh, the the first project thing. what you got so it was a sarees thing uh, i don't even know how to wear I, a yeah, saree okay. wear a saree i almost changed 35 sarees that day oh ho yeah and it was so fun and uh, i remember i am getting for 35 sarees i got 3500 rupees <laughs> yeah. oh wow so 100 rupees uh, for one change oh and uh, even today the store in visa i still have that pictures wow <laughs> yeah uh, so that was my first uh, thing any celebrity with uh, you did a uh, rememberable modeling a craze hota na up to now it's very common yeah, for now, you to yeah, be but that time you always oh my uh, i'm going to work with him or something your first uh, ad is re- close to your so, heart so yeah more than an ad um, one of my friend hmm. his name is ragav okay so um, his dad is satyanand garu okay um, uh, he is a well known person as a guru of pavan kalyan garu and okay. uh, the lot of big stars okay. prabhas garu so all okay. these people have been trained by him okay in what so, way like uh, acting acting yeah, okay acting, yeah. okay prabhas garu all were actually trained by satyanand garu okay so uh, ragav is son of satyanand garu who is a good friend of mine okay so he knows that i am doing modeling and everything he did my first photo shoot <laughs> who ragav who is okay. son of satyanand garu okay so ragav did a photo shoot and um, uh, then they are doing some demo okay then sir asked for one female lead for that demo hmm. then ragav referred me huh. uh, he said uh, you should come and do it hmm. uh, then i was in hyderabad hmm. by then i just came for some cousins mari then i went there i was that's the first time that i faced camera okay. like acting camera okay. not a modeling professional thing. yeah mm-hmm. professional so then uh, satyanand garu was like really very 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 sweet person he uh, he told me couple of things like you know tips, tips yeah, uh-huh. how to act that's when i really go i wanted to do couple of ads like video ads uh-huh. till then i was doing only photo shoot ads okay you got the point mm-hmm. so because uh, uh, i was not sure about my dialogue delivery mm-hmm. and all so we definitely need some guru to you know give at least tips and training so that's the first journey i thought okay this is something that will take back to a bigger level for me that's when i co- i felt very confident to come to hyderabad okay because that's where my first big contact started okay satyanand garu is so what know. tips he gave you yeah lord <laughs> what you tips. captured yeah, from him i have to make one more video because he trained me almost by, like 2 3 months oh. the training went really well you gave the fees or uh, like <laughs> <laughs> it's no, a he was like very kind towards me he really liked the way i was uh, doing mm. uh, the way i have shown the interest to go to the demo 
and then he said like uh, he wanted to be part of that training session mm-hmm. which was about to start mm. then i really it's like it's like a big thing for me i know uh, mm. so there are a lot of big people who go there and get trained and it is very hard to get into his classes yeah. he'll not take uh, any random person who just pays mm. the fee so he'll select he'll okay. just choose people uh if they really have that future then only he'll take them wow yeah so i think you should must have gone for some acting and yeah. movies films so as i said i was always going with the flow i mm-hmm. did one or two films mm. which were on my way it's okay. not that i was going mm-hmm. uh, that way that a uh, couple of uh, film makers who was about to work with me in short films yeah uh in between what happened i worked with the other thing which really i got fame with is like more than short films uh, more than modeling mm-hmm. i got a very good fame with short films mm-hmm. so even today a lot of people know me through short films which i did and especially on uh, one short film which is prayanam okay subhash garu is the director who okay. is actually doing a film now okay so they are how many short films you have done till now i did almost 15 uh, short, short films. films yeah oh. uh, shubhash garu is mr productions main director and uh, they did 100 short films oh so in 100th short film they took me okay. as a lead and it's my lifetime uh, thing that you know you. Uh, profile uh, video that i'll keep telling keep. it to everybody that this this project is something i'm part of because by then they worked with 100 short films so they have lot of cast and crew Hmm. they can take anybody out of uh, 100 short films the leads they hmm. are uh, they did i know they preferred me and i still your yeah, journey so is really good. interesting i think <laughs> just a modeling and the movie part has not been get got <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah and definitely. you jump into other thing <laughs> but when i was just discovering your the sitting area just come back to little bit your house you have kept your tissue here <laughs> tea this is yeah, your tea i'm a very tea person but it's so creatively for small small things Thanks, like yeah. you have on my camera <laughs> to show this steel ka chota sa cute <laughs> From where you got this? So creatively, you have from IKEA or something. You like all this, I think. Very yeah. uh, creatively, you have done like small, small. So, yeah. what's the next segment where we can capture you? Is your this? Uh, so, well, uh, as a model, I have discovered you as yes. being to be fit because I am seeing you for so many years. Yeah, you're as really. it is. You look right. like still sixteen. <laughs> is working. So, I just want to know. what do you keep makes you fit like obviously people always say we eat drink water juices food what makes you fit and when i came here i was just watching is your mother area or your area no it's my area okay so, yeah. i just want my cameraman to focus on this i mean you can't imagine like the way she has kept her all masalas <laughs> yes it's amazing really i must you so you'll not be a normal cook <laughs> you're a professional chef no 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 not really yeah. these are something that you know uh, toppings mm. and these are yeah as you said few masalas mm. so but i used know. to but one used to keep in the kitchen why here <laughs> because i wanted to make it like more uh, you know uh, i want people whenever people come no i want that attention okay <laughs> okay <laughs> so and it is like it's nice if i keep it like this no i'll have some interest to mm. do it if i keep it in kitchen i don't think it will be like so what kind like of food kitchen. you can make like everything everything yeah everything mexican continental oh, I don't south know, indian really, I don't north all indian are like experiment things okay so um, i love cooking yeah it's it's actually just started since last 2 3 years okay before that i was like very mom's uh, Uh, food food person so what makes you fit i mean what kind of food level i see this area again i feel i'm in the kitchen <laughs> yeah <laughs> so yeah, this area it's like so more this of, is all yeah hmm. this i kept like a you know grinder um, and mixer and <laughs> it's juicer looks, it's like you know it's making in a bulk <laughs> <laughs> actually previously it was all these things are there mm-hmm. but now it is i just kept them inside so you have made one area where your foodie stuff is here yeah but mostly i am not using any of it hmm? except freezer and oven you know when i want my cameraman to show <laughs> us tell you when i when not i came this. to her not home this. i just thought i'll get ice creams you know or she started some ice cream ka kuch what we say chop but that's <laughs> her fridge where she keeps her all food secret food to Wait, look young and you know so i must i mean this i is just, see This is her food. I must tell you can explain what you have. My God, like so. 
These are all homemade. Yeah, this is all homemade. Yeah. Wow. So if you see, this is a mango thing I made. Mm. You can have, but we have to keep it at least it's one hour. It's mango outside. like yeah. uh, mango so what? This is for you, guys. I mean, this girl is mango what? This is. So this is this is pure mango without sugar. If you eat, no, you will be like. Wow, this is one more flavor of mango. Wow. So I'm not mixing any uh, nothing, a, nothing, nothing. No ingredients. Mango it's time is there. Yeah, mango. And what all these chutneys or kya hai? Yeah, ye? there are few chutneys and there. So are where like, you make? Like you make, your mummy make or what? Sometimes like? we make, and this is like a cold coffee. Suddenly, if I yeah. <laughs> so why you kept it all these uh, See, like uh, this? Like what is the agenda? And Night me bhook lagti hai. And this is sweet with kajus. Wow. She kept it at like one yeah. two months ka. Yeah. So if any time lockdown comes, so I'm not. I'm like this is the place for you to reach. No, but I wanted. Why are you doing all this? Like this is. Uh, it's it's all interesting. What's the idea? There is no special idea uh, or like there is special no fridge for her. Yeah. So she's not having any water or not. She's not having juices or you know. She's having a proper meal. And this is also something that I keep. So it is on corn and uh, carrot. Carrot. Yeah. Okay. What do you do? Like when you feel hungry, you eat. Yeah. Just it's like a just a one minute work. <laughs> yeah, like this chopsticks. I'll yeah. tell my camera so to come should... inside. We can tell our cameraman. See, this is the. So this is a chicken. A professional model uh -huh. eats all this. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a chicken. Wow. The way she has so kept it. So chicken wing. So if I really wanted to have KFC, I have. This is a homemade. Yeah, I mean, it's there. There's a chicken, no? You so only just, like yeah. Did. It's like hardly it will take fifteen uh, minutes to make that KFC chicken. So now. nothing outside. Like most of the time, you're most having time, your yeah. ghar ka khana. Yes. So all this made in house, and then you make. Why you need a that much big fridge? No, actually the thing <laughs> is now it is less. Previously it was completely full. Okay. <laughs> whenever, <laughs> whenever my friends come, they just pick it and they go. So for friends. No, it's like it's good to you uh, know for them if I if they are coming suddenly, I don't effort my time and uh, you know. You think so like, much, yeah? Really, I must no. say. So, so what they come this? and they'll just see. You have to explain all this. Order kar sakte hain kya? Mini restaurant? No, no, no. Uh, it's it's like they, this is something that we made for one um, mm. party. Okay. So we made chicken curry, uh, mutton, soups, everything. Mm. So we wanted to know what all are inside the free. Mm. So we just kept that. So But what was I want to know because mostly uh, getting this fridge is not an easy, easy idea. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So I did. What clicked you? I want to store some nice food, healthy food. Okay. Sometimes when I, whenever I come, you know, I have to order fruits. I have to make a juice and I have to drink, right? So mm -hmm. it is a long process for me, is what I think. Mm -hmm. So what we'll do, we'll take some fruits, we'll make a juice, and I'll keep it there. Mm -hmm. So in next two three days, I can have it anytime. So day. this mango, what you gave me, I mean, I'm just waiting for this mango to eat. Yeah. Uh, the mangoes which we are getting uh, yes, fresh. Yes, it's like fresh, fresh. Okay, fresh. you have removed the juice. Juice, and then keep correct. it directly, directly. and then any time any time yeah I'll, because a lot of my friends now hmm. mango season have come of so course a lot of, of course. people will come and uh, shutika we want your mango juice is and there. that was uh, chutneys also was yeah there. there's few soups and uh, cold coffee and so how frequently you change them every like week. every weekly week weekly ones yeah weekly ones i'll sit on it and menu will be changed Yeah, yeah, obviously. <laughs> and who who cooks like who? So it depends. You... Sometimes I uh, alone I'll do it. Sometimes my friends will join. Okay. Previously there was uh, mm, uh, we bought almost uh, a big bag of um, lemons. Okay. And we did lemon cubes. Oh. We kept it inside. So whenever I want to have lemon juice, I'll just take that cube and I'll put it in water. Wow. And I'm done. Wow. I just go out with that lemon water. A lot of to like. I mean, I'm <laughs> just getting little things. The way you have kept your uh, routine healthy, your food healthy. I must say. Thank you. That's But a great it's, it's initiative. Like yeah. I usually eat outside as well. Hmm. It's not that I'm very much you know hmm. maintain that. But I eat very limit, limitedly. Hmm. Hmm. It's not like uh, I have so much food, so I'll keep eating. It's not like that. So now it's done. Your uh, journey being into modeling. Then how you're fit. <laughs> and your fridge, I'm more attracted. <laughs> <laughs> Then uh, let's come back to when you were. I think it's almost 15 years you were doing modeling, yeah, right? Yeah, 12 to 15. Years. 
Yeah. You did your sh uh, short movies, everything. Right. Didn't you try it for something Bollywood and proper Tollywood? Uh, no, I, uh, I, I didn't focus much about it hmm. because as I said, I was always going with the flow. Whatever opportunities that I'm getting, no, I was just taking it, that's hmm. it. So I uh, hardly, if some friends come back to me and say there is some audition going on, so you'll suit for it, I used to go. Hmm. Few, yes, uh, I have been selected, few I was actually rejected, but I was, it's all about the process. So you I just, had your fan moment in your life? Yeah, I had a couple of them, hmm. uh, but uh, those are because of my short films. Okay, yeah, what so, was, you can share it. So, one person literally followed me till the house. Okay. I used to stay in some other community then. Okay. So, he uh, saw me in the mall and uh, we were actually thinking why this guy is following. And then he came till the house and uh, there he was trying to contact me. Okay. Then somehow I was like, and the other most... Uh, memorable thing is a uh, couple of students who are like four to five people they on my birthday they came from Vijayawada oh so I feel like I really don't I didn't do that much to as if now I don't deserve that much is what I feel because they just uh, came by road almost four to five people because in and that gang only one person is my huge fan oh. so all these uh, come came together yeah all these people wanted to surprise that guy so these people approached me on instagram okay. and they were like we wanted to surprise him he's a huge fan please oh. we want to contact him so when you had your uh, fan moment you met you went out of the way to meet that person so, did it happen uh, yeah yeah it happened that but i wanted to share it in a in a different uh, hmm. with a different question hmm. so ra now i'll not answer this but i'll answer this <laughs> what yeah uh, yeah so fan moment happened you can say the question how you wanted we can do that <laughs> no 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 that happened because pratikala no okay 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 that but so, uh, as matlab ek, you always have a crave na oh i want to meet this guy and i got it i'll go out of the way to meet him you have something and you did it okay so uh, no, I mean you did out okay, of the way to meet him. No, I ne uh, I'm not. I'm a, actually I'm a movie lover. I'm uh -huh. a cinema lover. So I'll watch all the movies. Hmm. So if you ask me who is your favorite hero, I cannot say because since childhood I'm watching all the hero films. Okay. Let it be a small movie. But movie. you have to like the people go out of the way to meet their uh, star. If you have to do for whom you'll do that. See, go uh, out of the way. See, I, I'm a person who get excited when I see any star. Okay. It's not okay. like one particular star, I'll, I'll do something uh, to meet them. But yeah, Sa uh, Samantha is something that, you know, I'm crushing these days. Okay. Like I, really, I don't know, somehow I really wanted to meet her. Okay. Is... You can meet, I mean, that's not <laughs> a big deal, the profession you are in. Yeah. So let's come back to your journey of social media as you know this at that time you, when you started your career social media we don't have that impact okay. the media was there and when this social media started you know the it's like a tsunami like every person is on the social right. media how you get get into that like obviously everybody is getting into that but then we see your journey as an influencer how you see this market and all the professional people are coming under this roof how you take this so um, I did one black and white video, hmm. which is like little bit of acting. Mm -hmm. By then, TikTok, TikTok was not there. TikTok yeah. was mostly happened. In you were there. You you used to do TikToks. Like uh, I'm not much active. Okay, that uh, time. But on Facebook, I did one video, mm -hmm. which is a black and white video. There's a lot of people, mm. lot of celebrities who really appreciated oh. me, and they really still it's a favorite video for them. Oh, like uh, I. Um, I met Jayant sir, Jayant uh, sir who is a uh, director of uh, Shankar Dada MBBS, mm -hmm. Kimar, mm -hmm. all big uh, mm -hmm. films. He is one very sweet person. He uh, also is like, you know, uh, really admire the acting that which I did in that video. Okay. So it's a black and white video uh, back then in 2017. Mm -hmm. It got really, really viral. Ah, yeah, I must it say. It went really viral and that's when I made a lot of contacts. Uh, in industry okay so it was never that I went to some some uh, someone's place and mm -hmm. I made contact it was always like coming, coming on, on your destiny okay so um, that's when I made a little bit of contacts uh, 
and then your industry. influencer journey how it started like influencers it's again like you know now the internet is everything yeah. like if we wanted to walk out we should have a phone and we should have everything no doubt. we'll mm-hmm. get it like if we want to order food obviously yeah. you know the phone is important so uh influencer thing is something that you know i already worked with brands yeah so now brands are also approaching me easily to mm. instagram mm. so it's again not a new thing for me yeah i was into modeling so becoming an influencer is not a uh, big deal mm. so it was also again so like, now people are saying that being an influencer is more earning than to be in a profession <laughs> so you find modeling is better like influencer earning more that's a more earning you have in so that so most of the models actually became an influencer yes. part mm. one and it's a trending thing right now right yeah mm. so yes there is uh, definitely huge money for the influencers mm. and in coming days it's going to be more wow yeah so because brands are uh, wanted you know influencers to market their brand by being like a customer hmm. not like a model model that's a line so yeah. if i am a model i'll just try to apply a cream and uh, it it's like a professional cameraman who is capturing everything but whereas in influencers uh, they are the common they people they are like they just sit in front of the camera and they just say that this oh. is the brand that i'm using and yeah, this is so yeah. nice this is working on that my works skin. more yeah so people are thinking that you know this is like Uh, they are getting connected like correct and then that's why the influencers are like more trending now and they are i think now be... you don't need to be a super model to be an influencer <laughs> like you know we see yeah. i think all the professional people from all over the segment they are just yeah. So, how you see as a influencer word now <laughs> it's good previously i heard that there is no uh, you know uh, 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 career for influencers it's not just they used to yeah they used to just think they are like people who just make random videos that this and all but they are really really making very good money even i have couple of uh, very good friends who are big influencers who wow. have 1 million 2 million for one brand they are almost getting 6 to 7 lakhs wow yeah and i have uh, literally uh, approached people who brands sometimes they approach me and ask do you know who have uh, 1 million 2 million plus followers uh, influencers wow then i ask for the quotation and i just ask them to collaborate they they are really brands are really paying them So there's no doubt the influencers are going to be more next rich and rich in next uh, two three years. But when you're already a pers- good networking, you have you're a model, you're influencer. Then why the third journey came as like yes. you got your own boutique? Yeah. Then more of a like stress, like already you can actually explore this field of influencer. You're doing well. Right. Then how come this your dream of you know having your own uh, baby yeah. again, the yeah. startup? Right. It's on. Uh, yeah, designing like Correct. you do have yeah. your designer uh, showroom right. startup right. so why so the thing is um, all throughout my life i was uh, doing modeling and being an influencer i was always chilling hmm. i don't think i have ever did hard work towards it as i said i everything was working towards hmm. like you know i was just going working for brand and coming back hmm. so i don't know what will be my future after 4 5 years Mm. So I always wanted to make it little more secure, because as I said, like you know, the competition is very high being an influencer or a model. So every day we get to see lot of new influencers, lot of new models. New things are market. coming. Hmm. So as it have money, uh, at the same time it have competition as well, right? So um, pratikala is something is like a very 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 special in my life. Hmm. So pratikala is. everybody asked who is pratikala hmm. but pratikala is my multi designer store name hmm. so pratikala means there's two meanings to it pratikala is like every dream hmm. in telu uh, uh, pratikala is like every dream pratikala hmm. and also it's like every skill hmm. so uh, in future i wanted to make it a drive in for lifestyle hmm. uh like if uh, if i'm a bride mm. and uh, i know how my parents will be like you know tense to where should i go to buy patu sarees where should i go to uh, take the return gifts where should i go to you know how to contact photographers so i wanted to bring all these skilled people at one place which is pratikala mm-hmm. so now it is just a startup the ambition is too high i wanted to make it to mm. 100 cr club 
uh, before I wow. have. Uh, some but you are achieving it. I think so many celebrities are getting associated. You are getting good right. exposure. Right. So any of your incident you would like to share or something? So yes, there is a very special moment for me with Pratikala. So when I started, uh, I started in the same community where I live, like almost 4,000 plus crowd is here. Mm -hmm. So it's very easy for me to network. Mm. If I start something outside, it yeah. is tough for me to, you know, bring back a uh, crowd to that mm -hmm. place. So almost like three, four years it's been that I'm in this place. But uh, until and unless I started Pratikala, I never even uh, spoke with my neighbor. Mm. I don't even know who is staying yeah, opposite yeah. to mm. my house. So I was like um, uh, somebody who is very introvert at the same time extrovert. It's like mm -hmm. I'm a person who goes to the party very early hmm. sorry very late and i'll walk out from the party very early okay so late login and early log mm -hmm. off uh, type of mm -hmm. person just i go to parties or like i go to gatherings only to socialize hmm. so um person like me uh, i don't know even a single person from the place where i have started uh, it's in mm -hmm. lanco hills mm -hmm. now so in lanco hills i don't know not even a single person now I know every every because single of your business. person inside the community, every apartment. People treat me like their daughter, and they call me for lunch. Um, because of my store, no, there are a lot of ladies, there are a lot of aunties who became very, very, <laughs> very, very close to me. With uh, your profession, they are like, yeah, they are like. Uh, now I feel my community is a place of my relatives. It's not like a working place for me. So celebs and all these are also here, how they are like you're getting connected for fashion costumes and all that. Yeah, there is one more thing that happened. There are a lot of celebrities who stay inside mm -hmm. uh, Lanco, even like uh, singer Sunita Garu is one of a very sweet and kind uh, person who mm -hmm. keep coming and you know. Doing so, shopping. Yeah, shopping. There are a lot of celebrities. So what kind of sh shopping lover she is? Like what she shops yeah. most Sari, of the time? She is like we... We know, yeah, she yeah, loves yeah, sarees, sarees yeah, but western is. dresses is nothing yeah we usually no no she hmm. is a very good customer for sarees okay. and uh, we have dresses we have uh, summer wear we have western wear and till now wear, what right? she has shopped it's okay you can talk about yeah she she whenever she comes she really buys good she what kind of sarees she buys like does now she is like she always loves to wear falling sarees not falling. that sticky and mm -hmm. uh, heavy because weighted heavy. work and all no mm. she is very light like you know yeah as we always see her so pleasant mm. uh, so she she always chooses that light colors and uh, so and she is not somebody who walks in like a celebrity okay we just feel like she is one uh, yeah, neighbor yeah. Yeah, that yeah. she's coming and she she just do her thing and she'll go and who's your next uh. so the other biggest moment that happened in my life is with Pratikala as I said that I have made a very very good contacts and uh, I had the, the network which I had uh, two years back mm. and network now which I have is totally different mm -hmm. now I know um, being in the community starting this thing I feel like I know whole world mm. you might be like wondering like how mm -hmm. I'll tell you because most of the uh, people who are my customers are uh, 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 aged people who are like maybe uh, 50, 60 50, plus. 60 and all. Okay. So here what's happening is people who are uh, 50, 60s, hmm. their children are in US, Australia and abroad. Okay, and okay. So these people come here and they buy and they'll just, you know, deliver it to their kids. Mm -hmm. So now they started approaching me mm -hmm. directly instead mm -hmm. of, you know, bothering their parents. So community's advantage is that, like, you know, the network is huge. It's not I'm mm -hmm. sticking to one particular but area. But they're liking your work also, the kind <laughs> of work you're doing. Yeah, so... So uh, the next moment you have to so share. Yeah, yeah. So uh, once, uh, once suddenly I got to know that I'm very close. It's like it's, it's a journey. And uh, somehow I really, really became... Uh, I, because of Pratikala, I got uh, a very important person in my life, which is Amama. Okay. <laughs> so Amama is somebody who sends me food afternoon. Sometimes she calls me, come down, you didn't eat anything for lunch and all. Uh, slowly I have realized that she is none other than Alu Arjun sir's mom. Uh, mama. <laughs> <laughs> so okay. it's like... Uh, How you came to know? Like you were not aware. Where you met her? 
so um, it's not that i don't know but you know i never thought i'll get so close to her uh, and she'll start treating me like uh, her hmm. own grand daughter hmm. so um, one lady who walked in into my store hmm. and she said like you know these are blouses which are from us hmm. so you have to customize it you have to do it very well huh. i was like uh, how much time do i have huh. then she was like hardly only one week you have this she gave me almost 10 blouses oh my god and huh. that's i'm i'm very new to it hmm. i don't know hmm. uh, like you know okay one week how much time it will take i was like I'll Huh. things such way and then after one week the other, one person came into the store hmm. uh, and um, he said uh, that lady gave you a blouse as no so i have to take it to us so i came to hmm. take them i was like okay i'm handling so i hand over and that person actually shopped almost like 20 to 30000 uh, mm-hmm. uh, rupees for his wife hmm. and then uh, then i uh, he left then i realized that uh, he is none other than ravi garu who is uh, own um, uh, father in law mamaya ah. mamaya to al arjun garu okay so and then uh, these people took me to amamma to me make me meet amamma to amamma wants to know what collection i have mm-hmm. inside the store mm-hmm. so she don't want to come she she call me up then i went and slowly the bond was like you know mm-hmm. day by day day by uh, day it was like mm-hmm. kept on increasing mm. and she started sending me food, food and uh, she started taking me to outside whenever she goes out any parties like wow. you know any gatherings and all She's not party party this is not still yeah. yeah yeah some like birthday functions and all and suddenly one day uh, at morning 10 o'clock i got a call i was still sleeping and that day amma said just get ready in 10 minutes i am mm. going to take you to some place i was like where mm. then um, it was um, alu arjun garu's birthday mm. there like thousands of people are literally you know uh, wanting to see him yeah. once if he comes out no they just see and they will feel happy so what happened i really got that you know inside uh, the yeah, alu arjun birthday party entrance like you know all bodyguards mm-hmm. and you know amma was sitting all arjun right. birthday party yes, you went recently huh. not party huh. it's in the house okay. it's happening in the house birthday house. party yeah, yeah it happened birthday. yeah so uh, morning he was meeting lord of uh, fans every, and uh, mm-hmm. uh, like directors everybody is coming to meet and greet so there's a hall that you know he's mm-hmm. meeting but i got an access directly go to the main yeah. dining hall and have a one on one uh, lunch with alu arvind garu okay which is like i don't think so if i if i did some film and it's a super hit film also i don't think i'll get a chance to but through your this business it can i have it i'm still you know i'm still processing it like okay. is it real because i met him twice uh, i don't think if i would have done some mm. film so you had a food with him yes and st- this this is the best moment memorable. yeah i keep sharing with everybody see alu arjun know, alu arjun was there yeah he is one of the very 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 sweetest i'm not saying is mm. this for video but uh he there were a lot of crowd mm-hmm. in front of him but he left everybody and amamma he said he came to amamma he said and uh, he amamma said uh, he asked like who mm. is she and amamma introduced she you not just you i, I also have fan she is my fan wow <laughs> so and then um, he said like yeah i wanted to take picture he said please please come come and he's like very 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 you had a picture nice. with alu yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> though it's not a very great picture okay, what it was in hari but yeah it's so it's you sad. had a great time having alu arjun birthday party yes. because of your business yes so yes. amama what kind of uh, lover she is if we can talk about what kind of uh, clothes she buys or sarees lover she so, is so amamma usually wanted uh, customization not for her hmm. but her for grand uh, bahu uh, is yeah. there sneha reddy is there <laughs> and all that yeah so on that day i even um, i'm glad that i met uh, sneha reddy garu's mommy ha. also ha, she ha. is also very sweet okay she i just went and i said uh, you're very beautiful she is very very pretty and she was like uh, uh, thank you and she feels like i'm familiar so she was like asking uh we met I, i'm not able to recollect and okay. i said no this is the first time that we are meeting and she said like uh, what do you do and i said i have pratikala and mm. she said sometime when i come that said i'll surely come so She's okay she's such a uh, sweet uh, mm. person so sneha ready approached you like for what no, no, kind no, of love no, 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 no. she was busy that day okay so, so amma what uh, alu arjun grandmothers 
sari yeah. what what kind of so sari lover she she don't usually she is like very 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 specific hmm. uh, about the cloth material everything hmm. so uh, she asked ask me to give that customization designs for hmm. uh, the kids okay who are the family members so i do those things sometimes. those things yeah. that was a great journey you made yeah allu arjun mama <laughs> uh-huh. your fan the no, most no, of the time you are spending good time with her yeah. and uh, no. can have mm-hmm. sit little bit and just a uh, little bit of your journey so we had a great journey of yours you know <laughs> 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 different yeah. variations you have yeah. like a uh, you know ek sab uh, when we cook we have different variety of dishes so in right. your life also it's Sometimes like that and you have to come for lunch <laughs> i will i will no your life also matches like this you know <laughs> you have variety you are a big thali so <laughs> in which we have different different That's variety of uh, uh, variety of things you'll have uh, yeah. get the chance to eat so jenny tell me one thing you know as you know nowadays when the girls come up they wanted to be into a modeling what message you want to give them like we always have been some see we always see a best part of it there yeah. is a criticism also so yeah. much was the hype was there yeah how you take that like somebody when comes okay i want to be in modeling or what you personally advise them and when there are some negative environments are also there where when these words come me to and casting couch yeah. you know this has become so trendy words uh, as you know some people had their bad experiences how you take that being into this industry what your take on that at this stage being into 15 years into this industry right so um i'm not sure about uh, uh, like when i was hmm. coming into this modeling i was not sure like what is my next uh, hmm. thing to do hmm. so i never uh, i was never a uh, set goal person like you know i'm going to do this i'm going to do that as i said i'm going with the flow mm-hmm. so it's hard for me to you know get contacts mm. so all the people who are like uh, especially who are starting their career into modeling so there is definitely a, a very very uh, wide scope of you know uh, chances and opportunities but it is just that the right contacts will always will take you to a right place mm. so where you are wasting your time you have to like you know you, you should realize sting. it yeah mm. you should realize it uh immediately because modeling career as it as i said it's just very limited mm. time so we cannot uh, waste more time on like you know just sending auditions 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 and just sitting at home we have to go out we have to you know approach brands we have to directly meet people and um, the main thing is like if you see my instagram profile you don't see A, or not even a single picture which will you know you will feel like what is this it's always very 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 decent profile like the photo shoots which i did and the brands hmm. uh, who approached me i did lot of jewelry th- jewelry brands you know a lot of mothers especially teenagers uh, mothers they are uh, hmm. texting me on instagram saying that you know uh, my uh, child who is like tw- uh, just 16 17 years uh, girl who is in college she wanted to become a model She wanted to become a model by doing all these kind of sari ads. Actually, even ads. kids also have started exactly. so much of uh, so exposure. So it's, it's it was five years back. This mm. was happening. This is all five years back. And now what happened? Brands are directly approaching people. There is no, you know, the the old pattern is done. Mm. The brands are directly approaching. Not the time like has it, changed. Yeah, like previously we have to, you know, go out meet people. We we have to make contacts now. whatever talent you have just you know you just keep it on social media people are i think the social media is the right platform for right, all the right. profiles going so, on so uh, i'll tell you if a girl who have just 2000 followers and if she is very good at uh, skin routine she'll get a lot of brands ah. she'll be getting uh, brands like you know uh, they can be anything they can be a cream they can be a anything um, you know lifestyle like fitness and uh, mostly they might ask Uh, to come to the saloon mm-hmm. and do that hair do and all so you know now the opportunities are like Dif- big way and it's a very easy in your time it. it was a big struggle struggle yeah mm. it was like we have to go meet people and uh, though we send our instagram they never used to care mm. they like don't send all this in instagram profiles and all now they want insta thing they wanted instagram, instagram. So that is the level of change that we have been seeing since last just 3 4 years after lockdown things have been changed mm. uh, a lot 
so now they, now they see the instagram profile first yeah so previously if i send instagram and I, then i go and meet they used to reject now they wanted to see instagram <laughs> and then they wanted to call so there's a big change big i change. think this is the good change you told yeah. about it right. and then getting modeling into a business woman correct how you take this a big change in your life so there are lot of things that happen because in, in modeling you have to take care of yourself and right. when you are a business woman it's like totally taking right. care of your staff so the main thing is uh, the main thing i like about me right now is uh, being comfortable in my own skin hmm while modeling there is uh, there, there is no way that i ca- i cannot go out without makeup hmm. it's because the field demands makeup hmm. and like you know i have to get ready very well i have to take care of myself and everything but um, whereas as a business person um i don't need really every day makeup to meet people and all because my clients really like me naturally mm. so i think when i was doing modeling i got only 10% compliments like yeah you look good mm. uh, because they used to be like you know actually she is a model so obviously she look good mm. it, it, that was that way and now people me being a business uh, person people started coming and say she is very beautiful I mm-hmm. never got those many compliments while doing modeling. Now I'm being a business woman. This is a yeah. And the other uh, big thing is like when I was doing films, everybody were like, uh, "Film doesn't have a big career. Why are you choosing that? You should come. You should do some business, or you should get married." This is what they used to say. Now, uh, after me getting into store and working so hard there, people come there and people say like, "You look very pretty. You should try in movies." Full so, talk. Yeah. So everything is like. Uh, you can you know. be part of costume designing also movies if opportunity is no, given. Um, Are you looking forward? Not really. I have much bigger plans than that. So um, my scale of thinking is little wider than just a films. So. not to be in that zone yeah, much yeah so we what was the investment so investment thing uh, i did it in a very smart way uh, as i said if i start it in some commercial area like mm-hmm. madhapur jubilees and all first thing they already have lot of competition in that area mm. and the investment investment will be also very very huge mm. so i thought to make a good contacts a decent crowd who should walk in and it should not take too long for me mm. if i start business outside definitely it will take 2 uh, or 3 years to get back my investment mm-hmm. depending upon the scale of the uh, business and now that i have started is a very small scale but it's, it's growing fast yeah it's growing very fast and now just in just 8 months i made almost like 2000 client base which is very 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 huge so that is your achievement yes that's the biggest achievement that i did in last uh, uh eight months and the other thing is slowly uh, uh, previously i had just only two small stores inside uh, the community mm. <laughs> sorry so previously i just had two come uh, two just small stores inside and now just i have extended one more inside like wow so three stores three <laughs> stores now three solid stores in the, such a big community is like a big deal big deal it's like we started know, with yeah. small startup and yeah. uh, so, so a lot of people it's not a normal store type as you no, said no, you definitely it's not a normal so so is uh, in future i wanted to make it like a small swiggy okay swiggy insta swiggy for people who are staying inside the community i oh. wanted to extend it to all different different big communities okay. with uh, i already made my profile with pratikala in lanko okay so i have my own client base And कुछ चाहिए तो स्विगी कर दो स्विगी ऑनलाइन स्विगी क्लोथ्स ऑनलाइन क्लोथ्स टेन मिनट एंड इफ यू रियली वॉन्टेड यू नो टू चेंज ऑल्सो इट इज वेरी नियर बाई ओके सो इट्स लाइक दैट सो टेन मिनट में टेक पिक एंड ड्रॉप पिक एंड ड्रॉप एंड द अदर थिंग इज आफ्टर मी स्टार्टिंग हियर lot of uh, ladies who really walked in and say we are blessed to have pratikala because um, uh, the crowd which i have targeted are two type of uh, people one is like most busiest and laziest mm-hmm. because if you ask me staying in such tower after coming back from work i really don't feel like going out in traffic and go for shopping mm. if i really have sudden party i need some dress and we ladies are always wanted in new mm. dress for every random party so uh, if uh, suddenly people call me and say shrutika please can you please uh, open the store it's 
after 8:30 or morning before 10 o'clock also they have that uh, flexibility flexibility and uh, they call me and they say some guests are here so we wanted to give some sari so we want you to open just for 5 minutes mm-hmm. so we still that have flexibility. that flexibility yeah, you can start some apps or something is yeah it? so no the thing is we already have that whatsapp group okay. uh, which is there and the customization that we are doing which is working really well uh, when i started i was the only person now almost 20 people are working under uh, prathika which is good. very very so i think yeah. your slab is going up only yeah slowly it is so good. like you started your journey with 3500 <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I now in crores. <laughs> Are you okay, just saying? Yeah, it will soon. Uh, it should grow because um, I'm planning on a larger scale. Mm. So the lot of investors who are coming. Yeah, there's one more big point that I wanted to say. Mm. So maybe this will be very useful for the upcoming uh, people who really wanted to start business. Uh, when we are like, uh, there are lot of times we feel very competitive. Mm. We feel insecure. That's when we really wanted to stop it. Mm. No, that's the that's the right time. You should you know you should think about it more because you are in the right place. Okay. You are, that's the right time. If you are in a comfortable zone, you'll never grow. You huh. will be just there. Huh. When something is like hitting you very hard, that's when that like you know uh, your 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 grow is about to start. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So that's when you'll start learning. That's what I have learned. There were sometimes. Um, uh, I'm a person, uh, as I said, when I was into co- when I was in community, first one two years, I don't know anybody. Hmm. And later now, I know every person inside uh, the community. So when I go out, I have to greet everybody, and I suddenly feel like yeah. I I'm not able to answer everybody. I'm not able to you know uh, talk to everybody. Just what is this happening? I just wanted to give up on this. That's when the lot of other investors used to come. Mm-hmm. They used to like the idea. They used to say we wanted to we want to be part of expansion of Pratikala, and um, Pratikala not just gave me a good clients but also good vendors and um, people who really wanted to invest. So when I was about to start Pratikala, I was trying to find investors. Uh-huh. I was literally going. No, I was once asking, you started, can you please start along with me. I was asking my designer friends, will you start with me? It's a good idea. It will click. Nobody was ready. Now there are a lot of people who really wanted to come. Now I am just waiting and I am just trying to pick who is right to join Pratikala. So that's the difference the which I had. So I think it's an inspiration. Never get uh, yeah. down so when people like, discourage when you. When I started, I started uh, along with one of my friends. Hmm. She have a lot of knowledge into her designing thing. Whereas I was just into modeling, I have uh, good contacts with vendors mm-hmm. and I can get the products but I cannot design the product. Hmm. So at last one tomorrow is the opening and today she said I'm not going to be part of it because of some astrology thing. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what to do. I was like I'm not a person who give up so easily. I was the I was only person I don't even know anybody inside. I just um, took a little bit of time like 15-20 minutes. I was just thinking what to do next. Should I approach somebody mm-hmm. or should I continue or should I ask? I should I approach a uh, marketing team that this is what happened. I wanted to give back the place and all. So s- I thought um, whatever happened, there, there should be a reason. And then I just kept that disappointment thing aside and I saw the future. So what is my target? The main thing where I was lagging was I didn't have target when I started it. I just started with the flow. Oh. When somebody gave me a hand, I make myself, this is the target I have to reach. So, it should be our solo journey by taking support. It should not be, you know, partnership or something. Then, slowly everybody started coming, they're walking in and they started keeping messages inside the group saying that some beautiful girl started a beautiful collection inside Lanco, you should go and... So I was not there in any of the groups by then when I started. Mm-hmm. Slowly now, every person inside... So, I matlab, like, it's your own journey. Right. People try, try you, okay, okay, this is not going to happen. So, you just fight it back fight and it, yeah. came so back. So, now, as I said, I was running for investors and now investors are coming and they are in line like we wanted to. So, I think do. at the young age, you are making a big mark, I must say. And you are very confident while I am talking to you. You are not scared of whatever happened is going to happen. <laughs> happen yeah, and yeah. even I learned some very good <laughs> tips from you that, you know, Bindas Jio and uh, what focus you have in your life, we should do it. I mean, 
I started recently. I have realized that um, I read or I heard. I don't remember, but that just it's there in my head. Uh, previously, I used to like chase, 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 and I never used to get what I want. Now I started getting uh, like you know, there's hmm. a quote saying that don't chase, just attract. So that's what law of attraction. Yes. So that's what is happening. when i used to run for vendors when i used to run for investors they never used to come my way Very when good i said line. okay fine this is my thing i'll keep doing i'll, I'll doing keep it doing. Hmm. i'll keep i'll not depend work. on anybody anybody i'll keep doing my work uh, by putting all my heart soul blood like, everything into it and then people started coming in That's i think same I, happened with the law of attraction yeah yeah <laughs> in relationships love also yeah, everything yeah <laughs> most of the videos are made na don't chase don't follow right. so that really happened uh, to me in your professional life correct. it happened see that's what i gave you an example also when if i really do film also i don't even think that i'll go to you know uh, alu arvin sir's house and i'll have one on one uh, food uh, lunch with, with him yeah and you'll so become so close to amma mallu amma <laughs> amma is most pre- most precious person in my life So I must say it was a great journey talking to you. I think next segment we can discover more yeah, as we have to food thing. <laughs> food I'll thing. I'll make a nice food for you. Fitness and food. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. So thank you so much uh, for sharing your thank up and you down so and inspiring yeah. that never get down. I mean, so yes. so many things happen in life. People discourage you. Ye mat karo, wo mat karo. As yeah. you and sometimes they discourage you because of your age. Are you chotti hai? You right. have not seen the life. Yeah, they do like this. this. It's a sudden surprise for all of my my friends. The young girl like doing so many yeah, big yeah. businesses, you yeah. know, being a so woman. They sometimes struggle. Definitely every business. It's not like you know people who are uh, uh, having hundred crores, a thousand crores. They are not having problems. They even have trouble. But as a startups, no, they have to. They are. They have to enjoy the process hmm. because that's the only time, time where you know they can enjoy the process. Later, they'll be super busy. Super busy, yeah. yeah. And then you, that the journey keep you pushing, pushing yeah. on your all your way. Right. Well, it was a great chat, great interview. So thank, thank you so you, much. So, so much. well, it was really an inspirational journey of this girl who started with modeling with a young age, and now she's an entrepreneur and. planning big big things in her life and people when come to her and say are nahi karna hai chhod do she'll do it <laughs> so that's the fund of life keep doing keep whatever comes to your mind make your ideas work so for more updates keep watching i dream till then goodbye